Hello, Better Off Guide family. Today we will be tackling a topic that is essential for any entrepreneur. We're diving into the world of websites and customer lists, two elements that have the power to make or break a business in today's digital age. Building a robust online presence is not just about having a website. It's about creating a digital home that reflects your brand, your values, and the unique solutions that you bring to the table. It's about making your visitors feel welcome, intrigued, and eager to explore more. And then we have the customer list. Imagine a pool of individuals who are interested in what you offer, eagerly awaiting your updates, and ready to engage with your business. That's the power of a well-grown customer list. It's a direct line of communication between you and your audience, allowing you to build relationships that lead to growth. So are you ready to elevate your business? Stay tuned as we delve into the step-by-step -step process of building your website and growing your customer list. Scene script. First things first, let's dive into building your website. Building a website can seem like a monumental task, but fear not. Let's break it down into manageable steps. Step one, select a domain name. This is your website's address on the internet, so make it memorable and easy to type. It's best to choose a name that reflects your brand or the content of your site. Remember, it should be unique to you. Step two, choose a hosting platform. This is where your website will live online. There are many options out there, but our recommendation is HostGator. It offers a range of hosting plans to suit different needs. Whether you're planning a small personal blog or a large e-commerce site, HostGator has you covered. Plus, if you use our link below, you'll be supporting us too. Step three, set up your website. Once you've got your domain and hosting sorted, it's time to set up your website. Most hosting platforms, including HostGator, offer easy to use website builders. These tools allow you to create a website without needing to know any code. Simply choose a template that suits your style, then customize it with your own text, images, and other content. Step four, design your website. This is where you get to let your creativity shine. Think about the look and feel you want for your site. Do you want it to be sleek and professional, fun and colorful, minimalist and clean? The choice is yours. But remember, your design should reflect your brand and appeal to your target audience. When designing your site, keep navigation in mind. Make it easy for visitors to find what they're looking for. This could mean having a clear menu bar, a search function, or both. Also, don't forget about mobile users. These days, more people are browsing the web on their phones than on desktop computers. So, make sure your site looks good and works well on all screen sizes. Another important aspect of website design is SEO or search engine optimization. This is about making your site easy to find on search engines like Google. To improve your SEO, use relevant keywords in your content, add alt text to your images, and make sure your site loads quickly. Finally, always keep your audience in mind. Your website is not just about you and what you want, it's about your visitors and what they need. So always strive to provide value, whether that's through informative blog posts, helpful resources, or an easy to use online store. And voila, you've built your website. Now let's move on to growing your customer list. Now that your website is up and running, it's time to focus on growing your customer list. Why is having a customer list important, you might ask? Well, it's a direct line to your audience. When you have a list of people who have shown interest in your product or service, it means you have a group of potential customers who are just one great offer away from making a purchase. It's like having a gold mine of opportunities right at your fingertips. So, how do you go about growing your customer list? Let's break it down into four simple steps. Step one, create valuable content. If you want people to give you their contact information, you need to give them something in return. And that something needs to be valuable. Whether it's a blog post, a video, an ebook, or a podcast, make sure it's something your audience will find useful. Remember, the more value you provide, the more likely people are to trust you and want to hear more from you in the future. Step two, leverage social media. Social media platforms are a fantastic way to reach a larger audience. You can use them to share your content, engage with your followers, and encourage people to sign up for your list. But remember, it's not just about broadcasting your message. It's also about listening to what your followers have to say and engaging with them in a meaningful way. Step three, optimize for SEO. Search engine optimization, or SEO, is all about making your website more visible to people who are searching for products or services like yours. By using relevant keywords and creating high-quality content, you can improve your website's ranking on search engine results pages. This will drive more traffic to your website, 
giving you more opportunities to grow your customer list. And finally, step four, use email marketing. Once you have a list of potential customers, you can start sending them regular emails. These could be newsletters, promotional offers, or updates about your business. The key here is to provide value in every email. You don't want to spam your list with constant sales pitches. Instead, aim to build a relationship with your subscribers by providing them with useful information and exclusive offers. Remember, a bigger customer list means a larger potential customer base. Keep these tips in mind as you work on growing your list. Remember to check out HostGator Hosting through our link below to get started on your journey to building a successful website and growing your customer list. And as always, keep striving for better. Before we wrap up, let's take a moment to recap what we've discussed today. We've embarked on a thrilling journey, exploring the ins and outs of building a website and nurturing a burgeoning customer list. First, we delved into the exciting world of website creation. We learned that it doesn't have to be an intimidating task. With the right tools and a dash of creativity, anyone can create a stunning online presence. We talked about choosing the perfect domain name, one that resonates with your brand and is easy to remember. We also discussed the importance of selecting a reliable hosting platform and how HostGator can provide a secure and high-performing home for your website. Next, we moved on to growing your customer list. We emphasized the importance of crafting a compelling opt-in offer, something that provides real value to your potential customers and persuades them to share their email addresses with you. We also explored various strategies to promote your opt-in offer from leveraging social media and SEO to using paid advertising. And let's not forget about email marketing. We discussed how to use this powerful tool to nurture relationships with your customers, provide them with valuable content, and ultimately convert them into loyal patrons of your business. Remember, you can start your website journey with HostGator. It's a user-friendly platform that offers 24 seven support and a 99.9% .9 uptime guarantee. You can try it out through our link below. This not only supports us, but also gets you a fantastic deal on your hosting package. That's all for today, Better Off Guide family. Remember, a strong online presence and an engaged customer list are key to your business growth. Until next time, keep striving for better.